All right. Still at it with the same couple of drillers, if they hang around. One of them is already gone. So that's just how people play this game. Around the pots of gold, barkeep, and hold the rainbows this time. I've sort of stopped thinking about the amount of experience that you get per mission, but I do still like to do missions with modifiers when possible. Although this time it's just a coincidence because I'm just doing my assignment, but you know. I'm also not swishing off Burning Hell Volatile Bullets because I'm stubborn. So I guess, you know, we'll see how it works out. Should be fine. Again, you can play around it. When a pack of grunts gets frozen, it's fine to thaw them all, because it just kills them quicker. It's just Praetorians. But, you know, basically just back up. Instead of just brain dead and wanting right next to it and setting it on fire. Because that's what the driller is going to do. Driller is going to hold down M1 no matter what. You can't stop him. Even if he had voice chat on, you could not stop him. Well, that's not good. Goodbye. I lived! I never would have fucking expected to live there. It's just a speedrun strat, bro. Don't worry about it. Hopefully we're not missing too much nitro by leaving those loot bugs behind. Probably like 15 or so. Oh wow, he's fucking dead. Well, I guess in that case, welcome to the team, Bosco. Now that I'm by myself, I'm more fine with slow rolling it and getting these loot bugs. Don't blow me around again, please. Loot bugs are exclusively for bullying. Well known. Sorry, little bug. Your own fault for being full of goodies. Born ready. Ah, yep, there is nitro up here. Well, now I'm glad that I came back. Come here. I wonder if they'll ever actually change Molly's AI to be better. Probably not, because now it's like a universe in-joke. Enough people complained about it, so they just made the dwarves complain about it too. So now they can't get rid of it. But you know, I... Speaking for myself, I would rather if Molly was a little smarter and didn't just like move and push you around during swarms. I would rather that than the joke, if I'm being real with you. Oh yeah, I have pots of gold. Didn't be mining like that. Whatever. I don't actually care that much about the gold. It's just nice to have number go up. That is a very inconveniently placed low hole. That will probably be a pain in the ass on the way back if we have to go past that point. I forgot these exist. Like two nitra. Augers. That's how that's supposed to go. Oh, this is not where I wanted to be. This is suboptimal. No! No more bugs, please? How 
is that mule leg already visible? And why are you hanging out all the way back here? Your AI has been real screwy lately. Excuse me? Okay, I got him. I thought those both missed for a second. Is it backwards? Not backwards. That's great to hear. Usually, they just make you backtrack all the way back to the start whenever you scan one of those. Hello, Bosco? Thank you. Hello. Oh my god. You know what? No, I'm not pulling down E on that. That picks too long. Ah. Why do you generate like this? Not ready. This is a big fucking cave. This might be the biggest cave in this biome I've actually seen. Not that I'm seeing it anymore. Me. That's not great. That's also not great. Deleted. Deleted. Now you. I do not want... Ah, uh, I'm probably dead. I forgot to switch off field medic. Okay. That's it for me. Well. <sighs> On the positive side, I haven't bothered to swap out Bosco's triple revives yet, even though I probably should, because I don't die that much. Usually. Fingers crossed. the arc I wanted. Actually, no, I didn't swap- I didn't forget to swap out Field Medic. There was just a guy with me at the start that I already forgot about. He, you know, maybe his connection just dipped out because he left at a weird time. You're still not on fire, huh? More guys. Cool. And get stuck going through here, which is good. Looks like the warden is being weird and janky again and not following. As they are wont to do. Ever since, like, I don't know, a few updates ago, maybe. Excuse me, did you block that with your leg? Incredibly rude. And now the thing that I didn't want to happen has happened for this fucking guy. Then spitting out babies. Oh my god, that's so much damage. Volatile bullets. Disgusting. I think that cave leech is still alive. I don't think Bosco killed it. No. Go away. At some point, I would love to actually... What? I might as well call this. I would love to actually start doing the objective instead of killing all these bugs. Might be a couple more years, though.
See that? That is a beautiful mess of sounds right there. When a bunch of bugs is coming at you, and you're holding down the fire button, and they're all both getting shot and also lighting on fire. That's a great sound. Just a better noise than the flamethrower. The flamethrower is like a weak whoosh sound. Minigun sounds great, and you also still get the sound of the bugs. That, like, thwomp sound when they ignite. I guess Bosco did get it. That's so weird. I feel like I didn't see him kill it. Grabbing ammo. Now someone's joining. Notice me, please. Excellent aim, as always. What's this guy's ping? Pretty good. That's good for him, because he's playing Scout, and Scout feels pretty bad if you have bad ping. Yeah, you can get it. Freezing it or something. walk at him instead of me. That's unfortunate. He is a smart enough scout. Just let me kill all the trash. That it should be, to be honest. Not really a lazy scout thing, just like... intelligent, basically. Not that you can't do any swarm clear, but a lot of the time you kind of shouldn't when there's a dude standing there with a burning hell minigun or flamer or whatever. Breach cutter, etc. Like almost, almost anything but what Scout can carry. O.F. Carlo. Excuse me? RNG, please? Thank you. I just want to watch the minerals scatter, man. Every time the scout says help, for a second I actually think, like, oh shit, I ought to help. But no, he's not- he's not downed. He's just complaining about falling too fast. more guys, huh? This is basically a swarm at this point. But it's probably because people are digging up legs. I always forget about this, but like, people I say makes it a bit ambiguous as if it wasn't me. I always forget this, but 
digging up legs and like scanning for like stuff like that. At least some of that stuff prompts waves. Which is probably why there's so many bugs right now. If you're doing things carefully, or if there's already some trouble. You shouldn't actually work on the mules. It'll cause problems. I think that's Diamond 3, by the way. Connection is kind of bad, but he's not the scout, he's the NG, so that's fine. Probably. It would be less fine if he was using, like, RJ250, but he's probably not, because most people don't. I need more ammo. Goodbye. That's three menaces. What the fuck? I definitely need ammo. Don't even be bothering. I'm taking some of the ammo. Just eating two of these. Screw it. Give me my minigun ammo. Site. I was born to wait for the recharge. I didn't actually say hello to that guy, but I should probably do I have a do I have a voice chat bound? Might not. I'm not fixing it now. down E like a good dwarf. that guy make a death sound? Maybe the fire killed him. I'll take the body shots. someone walking. Hello? There he is. For a second I felt like I heard a leech, but I'm pretty sure it was the scout's flare or something. There's a lot of nitro on this map. To be fair, maybe we just finished it quickly. Time to restock. Pretty sure that man of culture is using hover clock.
that drop part fixed. Remember, you can always deposit on the side of the drop part. I'm sure that scout was fine with being set on fire right there, considering his ankles are getting eaten. The game's getting a bit framey. That was an accidental shield boost. Because I think that's another thing that's set to E. Like everything in this game. I should have just eaten though. Flies at the other location, because that guy never went for him. Steamed bugs. That one's dead. I feel like fire is somewhere around 72 damage usually. Something like that. That guy is jumping in front of my line of fire, so maybe I should just stay over here. Bit of friendly player never hurt anyone. I guess I will. Not the best location I've ever seen. Fuel cells have arrived. Get them connected to the drop pod. I'll do this, so I can make his platform fortress if that's what he wants. It probably is. Or do that. So I guess he doesn't need to so much, because it's mostly enclosed already. Don't regen. Stop having your health bar go back up. Doesn't show up there. Doesn't even show up red. Supplies are on the way. More up there still. There is. Well, again, none of these guys want to finish it off. We'll eat it for them. We have still have like over 300 nitro. We don't need to be shy about it.
I don't really like this kind of very enclosed strat. I feel like it lets the bugs sneak up around the rim more easily. I like to have wide open line of sight. But I'm not gonna like, you know, bitch people out over the strat they're doing. It's not that big of a deal. I will passive aggressively talk about it in a video though. Do you like this? We can't see the guys coming as easy. I want to kill them before they get down here, not like immediately after. Now we're like back into a corner here. Steam all the bugs. And then it's going to be very hard to kill from this position. We'll keep regenerating. When it's out of line of sight. Here, buggos. I will say, I think if you got like Mactero Plague, this setup makes more sense. As is like this though, I feel like it's pretty dubious. Just get him. Well, the last shot was a headshot, at least. is not ideal. Get out of here. It's fine. Dwarfs can't get cancer. Probably. I thought that flare was gonna kill that guy. I don't actually know how much damage flares do. It's probably like five. Yeah, my game feels pretty framey. Maybe it's all these particle effects. Maybe I should turn down my settings a little. Not right now. Stuff is happening. Oh, pod leaving. I'm stupid, actually? But it's fine, I realized eventually. Just bumping. I'm gonna pretend that I have zero downs here, because it was a fucked up cave leech down. Getting close to 25 again. I'm gonna be at Platinum on this guy pretty soon. Much sooner than Angier Driller. That's getting pretty close too.